What's going on, my good people? Got a little biz concerning the update to Lexi's Guide. So let's get that stuff sorted. Um, the first thing I want to get sorted is uh, SKSE. We updated the, um, the runtime, but we didn't update the, the scripts, this part right here. So what we're going to want to do is download uh, SKSE once again. And remember, we went to SE version, not the BR, or the classic. So SE, let's go ahead and download that. Okay. And before we install the scripts, let's go ahead and make sure we back up something. Open up SKSE scripts, right click, open in Explorer. Uh, the SKSC folder, remember we, we created an INI for it. We don't want to lose that. So let's right click, cut, paste it somewhere safe. I'm putting it on the desktop for now. Okay. And now click the add from uh, archive, install a new mod from archive, press that button. Mine points me directly to my download folder. You may need to navigate to it. Um, click on that folder, open. And we wanted to uh, make sure the name matches what we're gonna replace. So. Uh, S K S E scripts. Okay. Then, uh, okay. After we've done that, right click, set as data directory, click on data, right click, set as data directory. Here's the scripts. Click OK. And we're going to replace it. Okay. And you'll see here the categories and like the version number and stuff uh, was reset. Uh, you can go ahead and re um, you can go ahead and redo that if you want. Remember, you can just right click information and go into uh, Nexus Info, and here you could manually enter the version number. Uh, the mod ID number is still good, and the category is still good, just um, you could redo the version number here. I'm not going to concern myself. And then after that, open up that folder again, and then uh, cut and paste this folder back in. Cool. Okay. All right, the next bit of biz concerns the great city of Marthal, no snow under the roof bridge patch. Apparently, I neglected to clean it. So let's make sure that gets done. Let's clean that. So in a drop down here, go to SSZ at a quick auto clean run. And in the filter up here, I'm going to type in Mort, <laughs> short for Morthal, and locate that patch. There it is. Not safe for, not safe for work. What am I, what am I thinking? Get your head out of the gutter, JT. Uh, no snow under the roof bridge patch right here. Click on that box. Click on OK. Excellent. Quick auto clean mode finished. Background loader finished. We're good to move on. So let's go ahead and just close it out. Okay, so the next bit that we're going to deal with is uh, carriage and ferry travel overhaul fixes in Winterhold. There was an additional SSC edit here that was added, apparently after I made the videos. Uh, thanks once again to Morton uh, for spotting this. Um, this is something that you can do when you originally install the Great City of Morthal CFDO patch because it needed to... You needed to wait for this step until after you got to this point. All right, so what are we going to do? We're going to clean the Great City of Morthal CFTO patch. So in the drop down, go to SSE Edit, Quick Auto Clean. Then up here, I'm going to type in CFTO and locate the Great City of Morthal. Click OK and let it do its thing. OK, so we got our message Quick Clean Mode Finish, Background Loader finished. That's it. So we can go ahead and exit out. All right, the next bit of biz, apparently, um, some of the things I was supposed to update, I just downloaded the same old version and reinstall those. So <laughs> let's let's sort that out. Mostly HA inconsistency patches. We're gonna download the latest version of that. So this is in the miscellaneous section. Let's go and download this. Files. Let's go to the miscellaneous section. Mostly HA inconsistency fix. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that's the one. All right, my well, magic download. And while we're here. Uh, there was another one I didn't do properly. Miscellaneous merge consistency patch right here. So let's download this as well. Good. Okay. So now let's install them. So double click. Actually, first things first. Uh, let's find them over here to make sure we're going to match those names. So let's... Okay. I was rudely interrupted. Okay. So like I said, let's find these. Uh, make sure we match the names. So let's start with uh, mostly HA. So I'm going to type in mostly there it is. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. It's 0.104 is what I got. We need to install 105, so double click. Scroll down. Let's find mostly. There it is. So those names now match. Click. I'm like doubting myself. Yeah, okay, we're good. <laughs> All right, they match. Okay, replace. Boom, 105. Very good. And let's do the same for uh, miscellaneous merge. So I'm going to type in 
miss okay there it is let's go ahead and install that we want to make sure these names match up miscellaneous merge consistency patch good to go okay and replace all right moving on all right the next bit of biz concerns uh, the restructuring of certain sections of the guide i made a few missteps uh, the first uh, mistake that I did was I created a new separator called Armor Weapons Retection and Tweaks when actuality uh, Vanilla Item Retections and Tweaks was meant to be renamed to that. So this is what I'm going to do. Uh, to follow along with me, just take note of where the priority section is. I'm in like the 674 and up sort of section. So what I'm going to do is actually, because Mod Organizer is so amazing, is I'm going to grab this section and drag it just below... Vanilla items, retextures, and tweaks, and then I'm gonna get rid, and then I'm gonna remove it. Remove vanilla item, retextures, and tweaks. There. Now we need to uh, sort out the load order here. There are mods in places that they're not supposed to be. So I'm, I'm referring to Lexi's guide here, and I can see the order of things right here. So the first thing that's misplaced. There's several things here. Everything past um, rusted clothing and down below, we need to relocate these. So the first thing I'm going to do is just refer to armor, weapons, and retraction and tweaks. That's the section here. And following it down, coming to uh, Dragonbone Mastery. If I'm dragging down up to that point, uh, uh, my loader order is actually correct. So where are we looking at? So just after Great, uh, great Sword Sheaths. That's right there. So I need to drag down Dragonbone Mastery, weapons, retraction in my uh, loadout, it's currently at 680. And I'm going to click on it and drag it just below uh, Great Sword, Sheets, and Scabbards. The next thing I need to look at, let's see. Ebony Weapons Retexture, that's good. Keep on going down. Rustic Armor and Weapons Retexture, that, that'd be... Actually, that's good. Because Cactus Ebony Better Shaped is part of Ebony Weapons. Okay. Uh, rustic Armor and Weapons, let's see, that's good. Let's keep going, frankly. HD, Dawn Guard, Nightingale, Approved Face, Apotheosis, frankly, HD, Storm Cloak, Sigils, frankly, HD Armor. Okay. Now I need to find Naldorian Ancient Farmer. That's probably going to be up here. There it is right there. And let's take a look. Let's take a look. Naldorian, Naldorian, all the way to Aerial Shield, Zim's Artifacts, and Zim's Immersive. So basically everything else here. So I'm clicking on Naldorian Ancient Farmer. Then I'm going to shift click on Zims. And these mods in my loadout is currently at 676 to 681. And I'm going to drag it uh, be, uh, just beneath, frankly, HD Thieves Guild here. So you can just drag it on down. Oh, yes. I love Mod Organizer. And we're not done there because we have a few things here. Um, let's take a look real quick. Yeah, everything past rustic clothing. So cloaks and nords, I'm gonna highlight those by shift click or control clicking on that. And that is supposed to go under new items, just underneath, uh, yeah, cloaks of Skyrim, which is down here, 718. Okay, so I clicked on both of these. They're in position 674, 675 now, and I'm gonna drag it. Just bring it to here until um, my organizer starts scrolling. There we go. No items and just place it just after cloaks of skyrim all right great so that wasn't too bad just take your time and be mindful of what you're doing and you'll be fine all right and the last thing we need to do deal dealing with the restructuring of the guide is to relocate rda rdo patches final which is uh the rdo crf plus usep patch we need to relocate this from npc behavior to dialog and NPC uh, interaction. So RDO patch is final and my load order is 623. And I need to drag that to be just below relish, uh, relationship dialog overhaul, which is 638. So move RDO patches final into position 639. Okay, and the final bit of business uh, concerns Skyland uh, Solitude. Uh, evidently, I merged it instead of replacing it because we are updating it. <laughs> it's probably fine, but uh, better to be safe than sorry. I'm gonna I'm gonna redo it. Uh, thanks to Morton uh, as ever with his uh, keen eagle eye spotted this. Uh, thanks, man. 
So um, I'm going to go ahead and re-download it. And over here in my filter mod organizer, I'm going to type in Skyland. Because I want to make sure these names match up. So here's Skyland Solitude. Let's double click. Make sure those names match up. Click OK. And this time, click Replace. And finally, and finally, I had a request on Morton. He would like to see uh, what my specific uh, mod load order is, just to, just in case. He wants to make sure that everything of his is in the correct order that it's supposed to be. So this last bit of the video, I'm going to slowly scroll down my mod loader, um, my mod organizer to uh, uh, load out here, just so you guys can double check to see what um, your load order should be. So I'm going to scroll down very slowly, section by section, and uh, feel free to pause as you need. Or if you're not concerned about this, just um, you're done with the video. Uh, move on to the merge guides, which, by the way, guys, I know, I know, uh, they are going to be up today. I had them scheduled for 6 p.m. Central Time. The reason why I have it set at that time is I want to make sure that YouTube has a, uh, enough time to transcribe it into HD quality. So anyways, here we go. I have no idea where that song is from. I heard it somewhere a long time ago, I'm sure. Where the resistance? Lighting improvements. Something satisfying looking at all these. And there you go. I hope uh, this has got you guys all sorted out. I'm not going to replace uh, the videos with the corrections this time because honestly, uh, a week from now, two weeks from now, uh, the new viewers will be following the updated guide anyway. And a month from now, when there's another update, it'll make these update videos completely irrelevant. So thank you for joining. And guys, don't forget, Skyrim Anniversary Edition is about to come out come out so make sure you're prepared for that well anyways have a great day uh later on the merge videos will be coming out so uh look out for them and thanks for joining me guys i appreciate your trust and i hope you're having a good time